From the Quad Cities News Leader, this is KLEW News at 6. He's still working for the Senate. It's the 15th of 30 stops for Democrat Larry LaRocco as he travels the state doing everyday jobs just like the state's taxpayers. We first caught up with this campaign in June of last year when LaRocco was hauling garbage in Orofino. He was in that area again today, this time at the Dwarshack National Fish Hatchery in Osaka. Fish is an incredible resource. Our steelhead and our salmon, it's just an incredible resource that we should all be very thankful for that we have in our great state of Idaho. And the uh, mediation and uh, uh, the production of fish and the fishery industry is so important that I wanted to learn more about what they're doing here to restore the runs. Morocco spent the day learning about what the hatchery does, feeding the steelhead and cleaning out the pools. It was a little colder than when he was in Orofino in June, but his biggest concern wasn't the weather, it was keeping his balance. It's a little tenuous, uh, and quite frankly, I didn't want you to get a picture of me in the, in the water because uh, there, in each of these tanks there's 29,000 fish and I didn't want one uh, uh, candidate for office joining them, quite frankly. Now he managed to stay dry today. All kidding aside, LaRocco says this particular stop relates to one of the more pressing issues as November approaches, one of the most important resources in Idaho. The dams that we've built, uh, they have mediation associated with them, and uh, there are many federal agencies that are cooperating to try and restore the fish. And when I'm in the United States Senate, I'm going to make sure that these agencies work together and that everybody is uh, teamed up to make sure that we put more fish back in the river. Next week, LaRocco is headed to Cambridge to work at a cattle ranch. And I tried to stay as far away from the edge as possible, so I didn't end up in that pool <laughs> along with my camera and get in trouble there. Good night. <laughs> Fisher Communications. 